Hello, y'all. So it's that time again. Timu! <laughs> All right, we got to come up with a catchphrase for this, honey. But this time, I done really went all the way out because I am set on transforming myself. I'm tired of darn on coming up on here looking basic or whatnot. So together we are really getting this darn on transformation down pat. Like I'm tired of these darn on bumps. So I've got to get my face together. So, Oh, wait a minute. As far as this bonnet, we're going to get that together too, but we got the healing balm. We got the grow repair cream that's been helping his face out as well. We got our Sarcadia skincare. We're going to start trying our best to go to another esthetician. Because, you know, we need to treat ourselves. It's one thing for me to treat myself. It's another thing for me to actually let somebody treat me. As far as being on their table to deal with this. But really, the only way that this is going to settle down is for me to get back to doing laser. I got to find a, a laser place. But all of that aside, um, I say all that to say to introduce. Dun, da, 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 da. We got another darn on Timu order. So as y'all can tell, that package is substantially larger than the last one. But oh, wait a minute. I did not just get this one this huge package right here. But I got this one as well. Ooh. Oh. I got a big old box this time, y'all. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, well, I hope that didn't show my ad. Well, hell, I don't give a damn. Hope it didn't really show much of my address. Thank goodness the light is blurring out the address for the most part. I don't have to do no editing. Now, I don't like this package setup, though, because... Uh, there was some ants that there was an ant or two that came out of this. Now I'm hoping, you know, that was a one-off situation. I'm hoping that we don't get no creepy ca crawly surprise. <laughs> but just in case, <laughs> I mean, we got our darn on ant, darn on and road spray on deck because I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> now I didn't order no ant farm that way. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Woo! Uh uh. And then it was the big old flying ant as well. I was like, uh oh, uh, what what state did this come from? Because the ants that I have outside don't is not from there. I can tell it came from a different state. So the ant doesn't survive coming from New York. This is what dreams are made of. Lord knows, I hope it didn't darn gonna survive all the way from China. Lord knows, don't don't let me be the reason why the world shut down yet again, honey. <laughs> it seems like anytime something comes from China and you know it gets in contact with one of us, honey, all of a sudden, it's a, at first it was the, sw uh, the swine <laughs> flu, <laughs> then it was Dara going to uh, the Rona Rona. Lord knows, don't let me be responsible for the third coming of the world shutting down, honey. Hence why I done came prepared. So let's go ahead and get the cutting. I, I don't know which one I should open up first. Should I open up the box or should I open? I should have did a poll. I should have darn gone did that, but let's open up the box first. Ooh. No, we're going to open up the bag. We can save this box for last. Oh, because that's going to have all the gadgets, I believe. I think this has all the gadgets. So we got our signature Michael Myers knife. gonna go ahead and cut into it carefully because I do got clothes that I ordered. I don't want to accidentally cut my shirts and stuff because Lord knows I definitely need an updated wardrobe. Like shirts like this I've had since high school back when I was a big bitch. <laughs> now I can wear them like a skirt. Like let me show you how much weight that I've lost. Like realistically I've done lost so much weight <laughs> that I can literally wear this like a skirt y'all. I ain't got no darn going pants on underneath this. Like, this is how long this is on me where I can literally wear this like a skirt. I wish I knew how to sew. I would snatch this darn going thing in. We're going to play around with this later on to see how this would look if I darn going to snatch it into a skirt. But we're going to open this on up. Now, I got a total of 70 some items in total, y'all. So, it's going to be a lot to go through. Dun, da, da, dun, da, da. 
Dun, 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 dun. So the first one up is we got our makeup sponges. I think this costs like something ridiculous, <laughs> ridiculously low. It costs something like a dollar and some change for all four of these. And they had more assortment of colors. You could have got variations of purple, variations of light pink. I just got the all different assortment of colors. Feel very, uh, okay. They don't feel super stiff or anything. So you actually get pretty decent quality for the money for a dollar. I was a little bit worried because I thought it was going to give me Dollar Tree quality because <laughs> I was like, oh, it's a, it's a dollar and seventy eight, and I'm getting four of them. But this is actually pretty good for a dollar and seventy eight. They feel very soft. What's this? This is wrapped up in a whole nother bag. Now, I do got some <laughs> items that are on the each side of the spectrum, so I got to be real careful. Now, I wish they would have put that type of warning on them or whatnot, so I know which ones to avoid. Oh, this is from my air fryer, y'all. I get tired of cleaning out my air fryer thing. Y'all know how tedious it is to clean out an air fryer when you don't have a dishwasher. Yeah, hood apartment problems. So I got this. This cost me like $7. And it's a liner for your um, air fryer. So you're able to cook stuff or whatnot and not have to worry about, you know, all the stickiness. This is good for like dishes. Oh, matter of fact, I might use this tonight. Because the thing is this. Usually I would use my grill plate and I have to space it around or whatnot. But this would be good for my tofu tonight. I'm making some tofu tonight. I got them, um, you know, marinating in a milk mixture. I made milk, um, some Warshire sauce, some onion powder, um, some red onion. And I had all that mixed up together. And then I put my tofu in there. It's been sitting since 2 o'clock today. It's 11 39 right now so by the time I finish this hour long video I can get to test this out for the first time so I can wash this off because obviously we are not you know uh, testing this out just straight out the packaging honey always wash your products and stuff thoroughly before oh yeah it, it has that chemically smell too yeah you definitely want to hit it with one round of Dawn uh, dish detergent before putting your items on there So, what's the next item? Okay, this looked like my purse. Oh, it's smaller than I expected. Now, maybe it might fold out to be bigger. I don't know. Oh, it's a little handbag. Now, I thought it was... Okay, now, this is a little bit of a disappointment because I thought this bag was larger than what I thought it was. nonetheless look at it and I think this was like six dollars y'all now of course I'm going to take the time and put every single price of these items <laughs> so yeah y'all give me a thumbs up just for me darn going be diligent enough to put the prices in and I'm going to try my best to put the regular retail price as well because y'all know the discount prices always fluctuate but yeah y'all oh look at that oh yes this is just enough let me see Oh, well, shoot, I'm recording from my phone. So, this will be enough to have my phone in here, my stun gun, my lip gloss. Because I really don't need too much of items when going to work. So, this might be enough for me. And our lockers aren't but so big anyways. Like, our lockers are little teeny tiny lockers. So, yeah, this will be a good bag. Nice and flashy and whatnot. This is good for darn on five, six dollars. This cost me under ten dollars. I don't know what the cost was, but I know it was under ten dollars. This is oh, look at it, y'all. <laughs> okay, that's it. I got a couple more, I think, in here as well. Oh, I've been seeing this on Instagram. We finally get to try this out. Cause y'all know I've been using my Juvia's Place bomb for the longest. 
Now this supposed to be that honey bomb. Let let's let's go ahead and see what this is working with. Oh, look at that. Kapavima. Honey moist. So, this has... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Well, wait a minute. That, this is a little bit of bait and switch. Now, this saying the first ingredient is mineral oil. And some stuff that I can't even pronounce. Okay, vitamin E, glycerin. Oh, the hell up. Did, did they do a bait and switch on me? Oh, there's some more down here as well. Oh, okay. Hold on. Push it out. Oh, there's the little honey wand. Oh, you can tell this is a bootleg. Oh, no. I should have just gone ahead and paid it. For, I think this was only $2. And you get a $2 result. But we still want to see if this holds up. Now, we want to definitely do a comparison down the road to the real thing. Okay, that's what it looks like. We about to test this out in real time, y'all. They give us a little honey thing to uh, play with. Oh, it's very sticky. Okay. Oh, God, it's strong. It don't have that sweet smell. I, I was expecting it since it was honey to have a sweet smell. Oh, I don't even think I feel safe, dog. I'm wanting to put this on me. Mm -mm. Now, if my lips break out, I'm suing, dog. I'm suing, I'm suing, I'm suing. If this dog gonna breaks my lips out, this smell alone makes me want to put this back down. Oh God! Oh, made my lips real shiny though. Shining, 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 yeah. All is winning, babe. Now, my thing is this. It don't have a little fancy slot. Like, I just knew it, you would be able to put this on and attach it somewhere. So, I guess I'm going to have to put it back in this packaging. Now, I think the original one that this is inspired after has something to hold this little honey thing. Or do you just put the whole thing in the container, but then you run the risk of it just sitting. But then, the thickness of it, though... I guess you could theoretically put it in the thing and it won't sink because it's not, you know, soupy in consistency. It's literally thick. Okay, it's not super sticky or whatnot. Leaves your lips real moisturized. I don't feel no irritation on the lips. But still, that smell, oh God. I don't recommend this just based off the smell. I'm giving it a three out of five. What's this right here? Oh, this is my darn on camera. Oh, shoot, y'all. We got a 32 gigabyte darn on SIM card. Oh, shoot, we in there like swim well. Look at this. So this is supposed to be able to record in 1080 HP. Uh-oh, did I accidentally turn it on? I hope not. But yeah, this is supposed to record in 1080 HP. It's supposed to be able to record at nighttime as well. Um, 32 gigabyte. Now this cost me a little coin. This cost me $27. Now you know that. You know that's something how affordable Timu is when $27 is considered a coin. But yeah, y'all, this is my darn on camera. This is the one I have for the house for my, you know, I'm going to put on that window right there so I can see who is coming through the house throughout the day, you know, coming to the house throughout the day when I'm not here. Good security measure. Um, Also, give y'all some backstory. Somebody tried to break into my house um, a little over a week ago. I didn't over panic. I was panicked in that moment. 
And I immediately posted on Instagram after the police and stuff was here. But yeah, somebody attempted to break in my house. I was home all alone. It was like 5 o'clock in the morning. It would be the night that all the lights were out in the house. <laughs> and I was like, damn, why would this be the day that all the lights are out? The neighbors are gone. None of my neighbors are there. Like, usually it would be like at least one of them. Um, he works all the time. Um, but usually it'd be one of them, but both of them were gone. And these old folks over here that normally party all the time, they wasn't outside. And I, and that what prompted me. I said, uh, uh, <laughs> now granted, I already had my camera purchased and I was like, honey, my camera <laughs> can't come fast enough. So yeah. And then it happened on April Fool's day of all things. So some of y'all probably thought I was joking like, oh, D1 playing a nasty April Fool's joke. Somebody broke into her house. No, seriously, somebody broke into my house. So we now got dark on security camera footage. Thank you, Timu. I got another one in here for work purposes. And I'm wondering, is that this one? Oh, no, this is the eye, This is the liquid eyeshadow. I wanted to see if there is a dupe for the Juvia's Place one. Because right now I can't justify just spending $15 on one thing of, you know, uh, dual chrome. This one costs like $4. Ooh, just the packaging alone. I love this packaging. <laughs> now, wait a minute. Now, if I can just get into it. There we go. Oh, something done popped out on me. Okay. Ooh, look at that, y'all. Look at that dual chrome. Snatch this on off here. Ooh, y'all, I can't wait to try that. I can't wait to try that. This actually smells like bubbles. <laughs> you know, like bubbles that you used to play with as a kid. Got a real plasticky slash bubble. Okay, now I'm starting to see what other people have said about the uh, makeup and skincare with Timu. That you get a real chemically smell. Like, it, they, they don't have the fragrances and stuff, obviously, like we do here in the States. But this, oh, okay, we damn sure want to try this out. Not tonight, though, because I don't feel, I just put on my nighttime skincare routine. Um, I got my retinol and stuff on. And, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, this was four dollars, y'all. I got a ton of more in here now. I thought they would have all been packaged together. See, this is the thing with Timu; they just throw everything together just randomly. Like Amazon, they would have had the common sense to put all the eyeshadows in one section, put all the other stuff, like put the cameras together. We got seventy some items to go through, y'all. Oh, this is another first for me. Now I've been on YouTube for eleven years. These are my natural lashes. Y'all have never seen me wear lashes a day in my life, except for one time. If y'all followed my when, me when I was in beauty school, it was this chick. Shout out to Carissa. <laughs> and Carissa, I know you follow me on Instagram, and I'm going to darn going to save this little clip right here to put on my stories to check you, boo. <laughs> because you did me and my darn going fellow darn going classmate wrong. It was eight years ago. I was in beauty school. Me and Destiny Dargon had Dargon Carissa put on some Dargon eye, um, we put on eyelashes, right? And it was my first time. Honey, I looked like a goddamn, I looked like a weird drag queen. Honey, them eyelashes was touching my eyebrows like they needed to be cut down and shit. Because you know my, my eyelashes are already long and thick. She put on these big old glam eyelashes on me. And why did she use Dargon um, hair glue? I thought we would just be able to pull. And I'm pulling and it's hurting and whatnot. Honey, both me both me and Destiny, we tried every sort of trick to pull. We we tried to use wax removal. We using coconut oil. And even with the coconut oil, we're rubbing our dargon. We're rubbing our dargon eyes for a half hour. It took a half hour for me to get them dargon eyelashes off. And I never worn eyelashes again. That what scared me. So, Carissa, it was your fault that to this moment I have not dared attempt to uh, get no lashes. But I said, that, you know, this year I, I want to look more glamorous. 
you know, as I come into my transition. So, da 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 da. We got some lashes, y'all. So, oh, look at these. And there's some other ones down here somewhere. But yeah, look at these lashes. Oh, this is really about to elevate the makeup because it's like what what's been missing with my eyeshadow looks is you know lashes really enhance the look like without lashes it just looks basic so oh i can't wait to try this out now flashback to high school and i don't know if she watches my videos or not but um there's this one girl that i went to high school with that she does makeup right and I'm going to see if she could darn on get these lashes on for me. She she knows she's better skilled in the makeup and stuff than I am. I know how to put on a simple face. That's about it. But she knows how to put on the lashes. I want to have her put on these lashes for me. So moving on. Oh, what is this? Oh, lingerie. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh. Oh, maybe this should have been put in the naughty section. <laughs> okay, well, it's too late. These are my... Ooh. I ought to try these out for y'all right now, but this ain't that type of video. But, ooh, yes. So, this the lingerie, y'all. Now, granted, it did say fashion lingerie on there. So, they did give me a little bit warning with that. How many items we went through thus far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... <laughs> 63 more to go. Oh, Lord, we need to step it up. It's 21 minutes into the video. So, what is this? Hmm. Now, I'm confused my damn self. What is this? Oh, these are the shorts. Oh, these are a little bit large for my frame, though. Child, I'm about to darn gonna put these on right now. Like, oh my god, I might have to return these. These supposed to be my darn on little fancy jogging. I, I meant my little uh, yoga pants, but this is large. Now, granted, I do have size 40 inch hips or whatnot. It's an extra large, but mind you, I went off of darn on China's measurements. They said a 40, you know. An extra large caters up to like a size 40 hips. And I got size 40 hips. So, I don't know. Let me go ahead and put this on and see how this fares. Okay, wh where is that tag again? Okay, so this is the front. Oh, this will definitely look different <laughs> than what I expected it to look like. I don't know. Maybe it might be different once I put it on. Okay, let me. Make sure I don't flash y'all. <laughs> we, we ain't trying to turn. We, we want to get monetized for this video. Okay. Oh, okay. They do fit a little bit snug. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> they come all the way up. Oh, okay. Let me stand up on my bed so y'all can... Ooh. <laughs> Make... Now, I ain't tucked, y'all. Now, I'm a girl that comes with a little something extra. So, y'all got to bear in mind, but... Yeah, y'all, this is what they looking like. Okay. Now, I thought they was going to be a little bit more short, short, but they is long on me. Now, mind y'all, I am six foot one. I am six foot one and a half. <laughs> so, if you're shorter than me, oh my goodness, these are definitely going to be lengthy on you. Now, when I seen them on the model, they was all the way up to her darn on, you know, upper thigh area, like booty shorts. These are definitely not no, <laughs> these are not no booty yoga shorts, honey. Which one is this? <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> y'all, these darn on items is throwing me for a loop this go round. Oh, is these another one? Okay, now this is what I was expecting right here. This is what I was expecting right here. And Lord knows my, my room is a damn mess. This is a junky mess. I need to darn on. Oh, 
Wait a minute, do I even have it right? It has that weird lining light -like thing in the front. Ooh. Ooh, okay, now this is what I was expecting. Hold on, let me turn this around if I can. Give y'all a little bit of look of what's going on. Yes. Oh, look at that, y'all. Oh, oh, oh shoot. I, see, David Wine be forgetting that I have titties now. So I got to be careful with how I flip up this shirt. Lord, I'm going to have to censor that. But, oh, yes. Come on through. Now, this is what I'm talking about. And I want to say these cost me like $6. Yes, got the yes, come on through T Moo. And these are under ten dollars, y'all. All these darn on shorts for the most part. Now there is one that cost me like fourteen dollars. I can't wait to see those. But yeah, these are darn on. I will have the price down below. But ooh, come on through T Moo. Now you made up for them red ones. Them red ones wasn't hitting. But these ones right here, oh God, these, these are gorgeous. But anyways, let's get our setup back. Lower my damn room so darn on junky. I got water bottles and stuff everywhere. Let's slide these on off. Hold on. Okay. It's a good thing I didn't wear pants at all. Y'all get a look. We get to test them out and everything. This is the inside of them. I go on in and put them back in a perspective bag. This is real big, but once again, it is more conservative. So if I decide to do some exercise videos, this actually is more appropriate. <laughs> now that one just me being thought pocket. Like whenever I sign up for Planet Fitness, oh, D1 gonna catch me a man if this one that I'm currently trying to pursue don't want the darn gonna get right. Oh, now this one right here. Oh, because I told y'all I'm tired of looking basic. We stepping up our game in all the different ways. And that includes the hair as well. Like when I have this hair confined, I don't want to accidentally cut it. Where is my scissors? Oh, there we go. Ooh, this reminds me of Solange. Ooh. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Look at that, y'all. Look at... Honey, I'm about to snatch this off. Prepare y'all selves, honey. I suffer from angenetic alopecia underneath this. Woo! Yeah, y'all, I'm giving silly. Hoppo, hoppo, you and me. Hoppo, hoppo. The little bit of hair that I do got is about 20 inches long. Now, my nipple is right here. This is where my hair stretches out with twists so about 20 inches but yeah y'all this is the head wrap so i go ahead and put it on like this oh hold on wrap it around like so mm. yes honey and this cost me like $2. <laughs> now, of course, it's been a minute since I've had one of these. So we got to perfect our rap skills or whatnot. But we want to leave that out. Where is the other ones in here? I had some others as well. Oh, there we go. There's the second one. At least I think this is. It looks different. I don't want to accidentally cut it. Oh, okay. It does have a little thing right here where I can just flip this up. Okay. 
That's a lot better. They should have had that for the first one. Ooh, look at this one, y'all. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> now I just need to learn how to put on a... Hell, I need a good trade <laughs> to teach me how to put on a head wrap again. Oh, my, my, my. Oh, it goes on. Hell, I'm trying to figure out which direction it goes on. We got to figure it out, y'all. But, yeah, this the other one. It looks gorgeous. Oh, there it go. Self-explanatory, okay. And then, of course, I will wrap it like that. Or does it supposed to go the opposite way? I think it's supposed to go this way instead. I don't know. But see, I think the gold part supposed to... I think the reflective part supposed to be on the outside. So, yeah, we got the... <laughs> I got to have somebody... See, it's not as apparent as this one. See, this one got the color where you can tell the difference a little bit. Like, the inside is all one color and this is different. This is not so much because it's all got that. Okay, I guess this will be the underside. Okay, there's one more in here. At least I think it is. Where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? Okay, I can't find it. So we're going to put our dark on little head. We're going to put our dark on little uh, family dollar uh, thing back on. Y'all got to bear with me. This, this is going to be an extremely long video. And hell, we ain't even got to the box. Matter of fact, y'all said y'all wanted this in one long video. I don't know. Because it's 12 o'clock now. We might have to split this up into a separate video, y'all. And I didn't even expect the camera to be in this one right here. I thought it was going to be in that big box. What is this? But yeah, y'all, this this is so this is so many items that yeah, I realistically oh come on through. This is my new turn mm. out with the old in with the new baby in with the new. Come on through turban. Because I said I'm tired of coming up on here. Darn on struggling. Looking basic this year. So we darn on. Now they was out of the other turbans that I wanted. They had they had ones in red and gold. They had one with a flower design on it. Yes. Okay. This gives me a little bit... This makes me look like one of the Dargoyne Smurfs or whatnot. I don't know. I don't know about this look right here. Now, I got to really have some makeup and stuff on to balance this out because right now, it's giving me Dargoyne. I'm Smurf from the hood. <laughs> so, I'm going to take this one off, but it, oh, it fits comfortable and everything, and it covers my whole hair. Unlike this one... I guess since I do have so much hair, y'all, this is 20 in damn near 20 inches of hair. There's a lot the dog gonna put underneath this dog on one right here. I'm still keeping them because I plan on cutting all my hair off um, within the next couple months. But y'all see how much I got to do? I got to tuck it in and all that, and then there's still some pokage out from the side, from the back. Don't have to worry about it with this. But the flip side, though, I look like the evil Smurf. I look like a black Smurf, honey. Oh! Y'all, I'm just so excited. Even though I ordered the stuff, it's still so surprising to see it when it finally came. Now, y'all know I got the adhesive wallpapers. If y'all follow me for my DIY videos, well... Hopefully nobody follows me just for that because there is only a handful of them. But y'all know I redid my tub or whatnot. 
and I redid several other things throughout the house using adhesive wallpaper, right? And even for this bedroom, since, you know, I don't see myself painting it, but we need to update these tacky walls or whatnot. I plan on maybe putting, well, I might go with black, even though black is darn on, this room is small and we don't need it to look small. I was thinking about gold, but then it might clash with this. Oh no, this got gold in it. So I might be able to get away with doing a gold backsplash or whatnot. Um, the same thing for the bathroom. The bathroom needs a whole new renovation. Look what we got for the bathroom. A floor mat. And it has this material, right? So this is water absorbent and everything. But look at the material. Look at look at it. It almost looked like marble. And this mirrors the black um, type of thing that I have on my thing. So it goes with the aesthetic of my Dargon bathtub because I, I wrap my bathtub in a piece of paper that has that brick-like material. So, oh, this goes well with that. But then afterwards, I saw that they also have the curtains. So I'm going to also get the curtains as well. They got the curtains um, that can mirror the marble. So can you imagine going into my bathroom and you got the darn on stone it has that stone like um look to the tub i got a basic white tub but it don't look like it because it got that imitation adhesive on it and then this is the floor mat right here and then you have the darn on curtain that has that marble like effect this only cost me like ten dollars and the curtains also are like ten dollars I'm actually going to put this on the floor tonight. Honey. I'm, I'm throwing out them cheap darn on uh, them cheap mats them de that demon got up in there. Okay, we got a shirt. Now, I'm not trying out no shirts tonight, y'all. <laughs> I'm not taking off my shirt, but ooh, I think this was like oh, it's a very teeny oh, wait. <laughs> wait a minute. Is this a crop top? <laughs> Oh God, I might have to try this shirt out just to, what the hell? Hold up. How am I supposed to get into this? This look like a toddler shirt. What the hell? Oh no. See y'all, see I got it for the dog on pride symbol or whatnot. But y'all see this shit right here. How the hell do even want to pull Lord knows this might fit Diva Wine like a crop. This might fit Diva Wine like a crop top. I don't know. That that's gonna be a separate interesting video within it within his damn self. Like mm. I don't know. I might have to return that to send me. Now I made sure the darn gonna check all the measurements. Oh, this the other one, y'all. This is a more deep fuchsia color. Oh, look at that. Ooh. Look at this one right here. <laughs> I just had to have it just for the color of it all. Y'all know red is my color, right? And look at it. it. It gives that holographic. And then you get the orange one right here. And then you got the gold. All of these were like a dollar and some change each. Okay, moving on. Then we got the college and foot mask because I purchased some other items that's going to be towards my feet area. And it's like, you can't be having rough. Now, granted, I don't have corns, calluses, or anything like that. But I do have, um, what's that layer called when your feet build up? Like, I do have that tough layer, but it's not cakey or anything. I mean, well, it is, but it's not ugly looking. Like, it blends in with my foot. So, we got the collagen foot mask for that. I think this cost me like $2. And then for my tub, we got this aligner. Because y'all know my tub, like I said, is very hood and basic. Really needs some updating or whatnot. So I tried my best to add some of that, you know, 
white adhesive thing around it, it still looks a little, ugh. So, to make it look more aesthetically pleasing, I got this for like $2 as well. Ooh, what's this? Okay, this might be some makeup. These might be the uh, the pack of 12 of, oh no, these are the brushes. At least I think they are. They feel like brushes. Oh, okay, they got another pouch. Opening on up. And I want to say these were like $2 for all of these brushes. Oh, and then they got other wrappings on them. So they make sure they well protected coming to you. They got the cover on them. So. Let me pull on them a little bit. To make sure they. They not shedding on me. You know how you get the. But see then again it ain't got no makeup on it. We, the, the true test is once you have some makeup on it. Let's see how it holds up when you put makeup on it and you start wetting it up and all that. But just dry, it's holding up. It's, it's no shedding or nothing in my hands. I want to say it's like, ooh, it's a pack of 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yep, it's a pack of 12 in here. And I got these for under $10 as well. Once again, they just didn't have nothing in order, y'all. Like, everything is just random. So, these are my crystal eye masks. Because y'all know I'm a woman of a particular age now. I am now in my 30s. So, you know, we got to use retinols and stuff. So, these are my collagen masks to help reduce these, you know, settling lines. These crow's feet coming in. So, instead of looking like this, we can snatch it up. And look about 10 years younger in the eyes or whatnot. Oh, and this is the Happy Makeup Palette. Because I was using the Fumi Decelafold um, blush palette to cover up this little beard situation. This we will open up later on because we're already at 42 minutes. But this has, you know, black girl friendly colors a deep red for my type of skin tone as y'all can tell i'm very deep chocolatey kelly Rowland slash gabrielle union complexion now remember earlier i said i had this foot mask right because of other items that i gotten da 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 so these are foot rings these are you know i mean these are foot chains you put around your your, your toes and stuff once again, Diva Wine trying to get a man, y'all. We, we, we spicing it up in all ways possible. So our feet's going to be polished. I'm going to go and get my nail, uh, you know, get my feet done. I ain't never gone to the nail salon before. Fun fact about me. Never had on lashes that I've applied myself before. I've only worn lashes one time in my life. Thank you, Carissa, for the scary experience. And now, for the first time, we're going to try out some foot jewelry. <laughs> So, yeah, this goes around your toenails and stuff. I would demonstrate that in another video. Um, obviously, we want we want to try to keep it non-sensual because, honey, some of my folks would take the comments to a whole nother area. I know some folks still follow me for the nails and stuff. They might darn go and turn this into a whole nother video if I start showing my feet and stuff. So, we're we going to separate that out to another video. We ain't going to do no demonstrations. Oh, this is another one. I got three of them in total. And they was like $2 each. Then we got some more lashes. So these are more thicker. Divified. Now I'm going to have to trim these down a little bit. Matter of fact, this is about the ones where Carissa put on me. And they just had me... Had me looking like drag queen, honey. Yeah, it was about like this. But I got to trim them down a little bit for my liking. And how they compare up against these. You see these are more modest. And these are the more thick. Va 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 voom.
Oh, and then we got some more. So this is a pack of 30. I think these cost me like $4. Once again, I, oh, I can't wait to darn on start comparing them. Oh, and then we got the brown version of these. So they pretty much the same thing. And hell, they're going to fit the same way. So there's no need in me even taking this out the packaging or whatnot since I already know what they're going to feel like. I'm at fit like. And then we got another makeup palette. Because I wasn't quite sure, so I ended up getting another one as well. So we will be doing a comparison. Skincare. Oh, okay. It's already... <laughs> now, they could have did better than this. Now, on the more expensive side, but surprisingly very cheap. Um... Uh, Vitamin C serum. This is a face serum that contains hyaluronic acid, anti-aging, firm and repair, protect smooth skin and elasticity. Once again, as a girl that's now in my 30s, all of these are very important to me. So what I would use this for um, is in the morning time before I put on my sunscreen. Yes, as a black girl, we need to put on sunscreen too. So um, I will put this on before my moisturizer. Um, I would do this moisturize and then put on my sunscreen um the vitamin c is going to serve as an antioxidant is going to help your skin throughout the day fight off free radicals it's also going to help brighten the skin so if you have little you know discolorations or whatnot so it's going to help out against that while also protecting the skin from free radicals as well now when you're using vitamin c you do not want to pair this with retinol close together so if you are somebody like me who use retinol, you know, use the retinol at night, use this during the daytime because those two will irritate the skin when you, if you try to combine both of those together. So to avoid any types of reaction like that, avoid your retinol along with this. But that was like $3, y'all. And then we got some lipstick because y'all know my lipstick game is very basic. I was like, damn, I only got like one red color, a purple. Now, granted, I did get a little paint kit palette, but it smears and everything. Uh, I said I really need to invest in some lipsticks and stuff. So, we got this right here. Oh, this looks like a very gold color. What color is this? Is this the lipstick or is this like an eyeshadow? Oh, this might be for the eyes. I don't know. Is this gold? This might be for the lips. Look what it says. Oh, this is liquid eyeliner. <laughs> oh, shit. I was about to say, what type of gold shade is this for the lips? Okay. I can't wait to play around. Like I said, I have a certain girl from high school that does makeup. Oh, I can't wait till she plays with my face with all these makeups. I might forward this video to her so she can never go and see this. And then we got the dual blush. Because I think this, oh yeah, this can be used as a lipstick and a blush. So it's this nice little pink tone color right here. And then we got another one of these. You better come get you one of these. It's an eye liner. So this is in the shade number four. Ooh, that's that more deep coppery tone. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, yes. Ooh, honey, I can't wait for the summertime, honey. I'm about to... And then it goes well with this outfit, too. Like, that one's the bright gold over there, and this one's, like, the deep coppery gold. Oh, I got another serum, y'all. Which one is this one? Oh, this is the Cortic Acid Skin Brightness Serum. So, 
Now, I'm not going to show off my legs in this video because I don't want this video to get flagged because I, I am wearing, you know, you know, sort of risque underwear. However, this would be good for my, you know, discoloration on my thighs and whatnot. This is Kojic Acid Skin Brightening Serum. So, Kojic Acid helps inhibit melanin production. So, for black girls, it will help, you know, you know, prevent um, post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. Also, for the guys as well. Um, for guys who suffer in the or women uh, that suffer from hysertrusium, y'all know I always mess up that word, where women have excessive hair and you get the discoloration as a result. For guys who deal with discoloration post-shaving, um, this is a good one for y'all, honey. This is good. Now, I don't know necessarily about this brand. We're going to test that out, and I'm going to give y'all my professional thoughts as a medical esthetician on how this um, stacks up against products such as Makeup Artist Choice and, you know, Sarcadia, etc., that costs way more money because vitamin C typically runs upwards of $50. Like the Makeup Artist Choice vitamin C that I use, um, now granted it comes with a payment. You can split it up into four payments with Afterpay, but it, it's fifty-some dollars. So that one for three dollars, let's see if it's it really compares to the fifty dollar alternative. Now Kojic Acid Brightening Serums tend to run in the same price point for this amount. Um a full um fluent ounce. So ooh, this is quite a bit. But you know China is known for skin lightening or whatnot. Um and that's a whole controversy within itself. Um we're going to use the lightning for the correct purposes though. So, considering that their, their country as a whole is, you know, into brightening the skin and whatnot, one can say that the price point is a lot lower in um, in that country versus in the United States. Um, in the United States, we have to go through way more vigorous product testing, this, that, and the third, um, animals testing and stuff, and, you know, all that gets factored into the cost, the marketing, the packaging, and all of that, differentiating yourself from the competition, uh, all that gets factored into the price point versus China don't have to deal with all those things. So one can say that's why the price point is lower. But we will be testing it out nonetheless. Okay, we're coming to the end as far as this one, y'all. Ooh, and right up on an hour too, thank goodness. It is 12.26, yeah. We're definitely going to save this for... We're definitely going to save that box for tomorrow. So this is another foot chain. Oh. Is this my lipstick? Oh, yes it is. And it's the metal, honey. Metal liquid lip color. Oh, look at that, y'all. Oh, nice, sassy darn on purple, honey. It's poisoning purple. Oh, yes. Oh, shoot. <laughs> it got the darn on plastic on it. I don't feel like darn on messing around with it tonight, so we're going to leave that be. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is my bed cover, y'all. So, ooh. And it goes with my background. I can't wait till y'all see this. I'm not even going to unbox this tonight. I'm going to change my... I'm going to wash this first. And then I'm going to um, put this on my bed. And then y'all want to... I'm going to take a picture of it. But yeah, y'all. This is going to blend in with my dark one uh, wall tapestry over here. I got my thing sitting up on a ring light, y'all. That's why y'all see that little light right here but yeah y'all this cost me like twenty dollars if i would have got this anywhere else it would have cost me easily like fifty dollars that's the most heaviest thing up in here okay we got another liquid liner this is in the shade 10 But it doesn't give me... Oh, this is the red. Oh. Okay. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> I can't wait to dark on get my makeup did, y'all. Oh, my God. Honey, Diva Wine is about to be a bad bitch <laughs> come summertime. Look at this, y'all. Mm. When I tell y'all, y'all ain't gonna be able to tell Diva Wine nothing. 
between all this right here and me now I'm going to get my voice together because I, I am going to probably do some vocal therapy as well. Because y'all say it ain't nothing wrong with my voice, but I don't think my voice is the most appealing and feminine. So I am going to go through some vocal lessons, as well, some voice lessons and vocal lessons. Y'all getting exclusive, but I want to release an R&B album. I'll tell y'all what darn gonna cause me to come up with that decision. Even though I can't darn gonna hold a tune, honey, I, I, I feel like I've done gone through so so much of my life. I need to go ahead and put it out in a song or whatnot. So I'm gonna do that. I, or, I don't know. I could go to other options. We'll talk about that in another video. But yeah, we're gonna darn going get the vocals and stuff right. Uh, speaking of vocals, I should have a mic somewhere up in here. That might be in the next box. I don't know. What's this? Oh, yes. Oh, I'm about to... Oh, yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Is it multiple? Wait a minute. Did I order multiple? Oh, this the pet set. Oh, shit. Honey, I'm about to try this right now. I know I said I wasn't going to try no more, but... Ooh, look at this. So, this says, it's fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. And it got the various shades of melanin. I'm about to wear this right now. Let me go ahead and put this on. Okay, now I can justify this video being an hour long. We can say we also did a try on haul as well. Oh, yes. Come on through. Come on through. Yes. Oh, okay. Then we're going to take this off. We're going to put this on. Now, you have to be real careful with two-piece outfits because when you're a curvy girl, like when you thicker at the bottom and then short at the top, it's like do it. All. Sometimes you run the risk of the shirt being too big and then, you know, the pants being too small or the pants being too big and, or, and the short being too small or whatnot. Let's see if it fits somebody of my frame. Body proportions, I am a 29 waist, 40-inch hips. Um, and then obviously no is non-existent boobitch, honey. I'm like a 32A cup. Oh, yes. And then the material feels good. It don't feel weird. And this is a good quality. Oh, this was $14. <laughs> I know that's going to shock y'all, right? Let me turn this around. Let me turn this around so y'all know how how shocking this is for 14 freaking dollars. And I'm talking about the top and the bottom. This was $14, y'all. Look at this. Look at this right here. Look at This is just enhancing all the assets and everything. So the pants, it goes up to here, right? And then this the shirt. Like I said, this was $14. Honey, Timu, you can't beat this. Fourteen freaking dollars. Fourteen dollars. Y'all see how this looks on me? You can't tell me this wasn't worth it. For Fourteen dollars. <laughs> I'm going to keep saying that. Hold on, let me turn y'all around. Ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. $14. Good quality feel and everything. This is darn gone phenomenal. This this is freaking phenomenal. We ain't even putting this back in the packaging. 
Oh, Lord. Then we got some more makeup and stuff up in here. Oh, shoot. We got another one of these. Because I didn't know how much I needed for my tub. Oh, see, now they got everything at the bottom. Now, for my hair, since my regular shears are getting dull, I got me some other shears. I think I got multiple shears. I don't know if they separated that into another package or not. I wanted to do a comparison. Now, why would they put the other one in a different package, though? Like, that's crazy. Because I want to say I did order... An, I did get two of them. But these are the holographic ones right here. These cost me like $5. You don't want to cut your hair with regular sheer, I mean, with regular scissors because it can cause further splits or whatnot. So, yeah, definitely cut your hair with shears. Same thing for your brows. My brows are in desperate need of some cutting as well. Then we got some more brushes. You can never have too much makeup brushes. Especially if you're lazy like me and you don't want a darn one. Um... You don't want to dog on wash brushes as often. And look at this. They got the ruby tip ends. Ooh. I want to say these cost me like $5. Oh my God. They so cute. I got to get out of this small apartment. Because I ain't got no vanity set or nothing to put them on. I got to stuff them in this little thing down here. That's the next major purchase. Um, I got this little uh, desk situation. I need to be able to put one of those fancy um, holders underneath my darn gone desk. You know the attachment underneath your work desk or whatnot. Like if I can add an extra space just to put like my brushes and stuff in, that would be phenomenal. Also, another major investment is I need to get a larger thing right here. This is so outdated and it's 50 looking. Ugh. I don't even want to show y'all what this looks like over here. Y'all probably peeped it when, when I turned the camera around. But yeah, I need to get a larger little Chesser thing right here. And then I got a deeper red blush. Ooh, that's definitely black girl friendly. Definitely chocolate girl friendly. Ooh, and then we got some more lip situations. I'm not looking forward to the smell. Who <laughs> don't? No. Is a lot of this stuff has been having chemical smells as far as the makeup and stuff is concerned. Oh, but look at this lip color, y'all. Like I said, we stepping our game up in more ways than one. Oh, which color is this? Oh, and this is a lip color as well. So this is a shimmer finish. And it's taking a sweet time coming out. Oh, this is more like that. Now y'all know I'm a chocolate girl. So this is going to be real hit or miss. Now when we get into like these little funky mauve colors. It's real hit or miss on me. Like it, it be looking good on Jackie Anna. But for some reason, it don't be looking as good on my chocolate skin, honey. Now, granted, I'm not as chocolate as a Nima Tang or something. Um, I am shade 445 and Fenty uh, or whatnot. So maybe it's the undertone difference. But I'm a neutral undertone. So you would think anything that works with Jackie would work with me because I can go either way. But what is this right here? Is this a little bump? Oh, yeah. I got to do some high frequency later on in the morning. Okay, we approaching the final set, y'all. Oh, y'all. So, this is the Magnetic Eyeliner. I think this cost me like $3. So, where's my lashes at? So, I put the liner on and my lash is supposed to stick with this. I can't wait to try that out. Now, me, I'm a little bit scared to do this on my own, so I'm going to recruit some help for that. So, for the very first time, for the very first time, y'all will be seeing somebody else on my YouTube channel. Because <laughs> I don't feel confident with Dargon doing that myself. Oh. 
Now we got a little soft matte lip cream color. Ooh. This is really going out the box for me, honey. Y'all ain't seen me wear this color in a minute. And I had it with the liquid paint, but this time I'm finally going to wear this color as a with the lipstick. Ooh, look at that. And a little um um aesthetic thing um tip, y'all. Blue, anything blue tone actually makes your teeth look whiter. Now, I don't got the most brightest teeth. Now, my teeth ain't yellow, but my teeth ain't the brightest. My teeth shade is a shade A3. Um, so, until I get my veneers, um, I want to have... I want to have a shade B3 veneers. Now, shade B3 is actually brighter than A3. Don't let A confuse you in thinking A is brighter. Actually, A is like 60% of Americans have my teeth shade. But I want that movie star white, but I don't want it looking super white. Like, you know, when you smile, it looks like I just got one block. I'm not trying to have my shit look like Nene Leakes and them, where it makes you look like Mr. Potato Head. Because on black skin, you got to be real careful when you get your teeth done. Because on our skin tone, if you don't do it right, if you don't adjust it for your skin tone, your eye color and whatnot, it looks real fake. I'm not trying to have the real fake. I want my stuff to look like regular movie star white um it's going to cost me about ten thousand dollars if y'all want to send a girl a cash app towards the t-fund we'll do a video on that and everything else or if you're a doctor i do accept now i don't say this enough but i do um accept business inquiries so if i got any doctors out there especially surgeons that want to work on diva wine in exchange for some videos honey i definitely don't mind honey if you know how to do good teeth, if you're a cosmetic dentist, honey, <laughs> inbox me. <laughs> but in the meantime, honey, this darn on blue lipstick is going to dark on emphasize it. Oh, I can't wait to get glammed up. Can you imagine, oh, that darn on gold eyeliner, this blue lipstick. Child, I, boom. <laughs> oh, y'all just can't wait. I just can't wait, y'all. Oh, what is this? So this is another eyeshadow color. Let's see which one this one is. Oh, so look at that one. That's that more silver tone, silver green duochrome type of color. Okay. And then I got some beads some bracelets with my zodiac sign on it these are capricorn then there's another one right here and then of course you could easily get your sign my sign my sign but yeah y'all got this one as well you adjust it like so for your own arm size. Then you tighten it back up. Yes, I think you tighten it. Which one's tightens? Okay, the other one tightens. You tightens up or whatnot. But yeah, here you go. This cost me like a dollar. Because once again, y'all, with all that I've been going through, I need some spiritual <laughs> protection and all that. So y'all gonna have y'all gonna see me wear some more crystals and all of that in the upcoming weeks. But this is a dollar. I also need to get me a dream catcher. Dream, 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 dream. And then, last but certainly not least, now, y'all seen me get these shoes, and they were darn going $29.95, and they are damn good for the price. I've only had a chance to wear them one time, um, because I work so much, I have not really had a chance to wear them out, but honey, these damn are good. So, y'all know I had to purchase me some more, right? So here we go. Ooh, look at, look at. 
And I want to say these cost me like $17, if I'm not mistaken. Even if these were $17 or these were like $25. So they sit a little bit lower. They're all, oh yeah, these are the ones that were like $12, $13. So size comparison. So this is the more big bulky shoe and this is more regular size and you know big girl friendly this is a size 12 which size is this I'm going to put this on right now just to see how it fits oh it fits wonderful y'all oh I'm testing out my flexibility skills but yeah, y'all, ooh, fits wonderful. So like I said, this is a size 12. And it is true to size. Don't think because it comes from China that you got to go bigger. You will end up making a mistake. Because <laughs> um, I think I got those in a size 13 and I got quite a bit of room with those. Uh, so I went a size 12 with these. And you see they fit very true to size air breathable or whatnot and like I said I think these are anywhere from 15 to 30 dollars so you literally cannot go wrong with these and that wraps up this boxing <laughs> unboxing right here so a whole lot y'all and best believe <laughs> this is only like less than half of everything y'all like this was the small packaging <laughs> We have not even unboxed the box, y'all. So, yeah, we're going to have to separate that out for another video. So, definitely stay tuned because I definitely got some more gadgets in this one. I got some technology that's going to enhance the YouTube channel. So, I got I showed y'all the makeup and stuff that's going to, you know, transform me. But also, the technology and stuff that I have for this channel right here, y'all got to stay tuned for that. Um, in addition to some more house items, some more clothes, some more shoes. I So there's two other shoes that are in that box right there. Along with some other technology equipment. Along with some technology equipment, etc. So, oh, and some clothes. Because I got a one-piece outfit that I want to show y'all as well. I think I even brought a dress, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> so, yeah, y'all thought this try-on was something, honey... Uh, <laughs> y'all really got to stay tuned for part two so in the meantime i hope this was enjoyable for y'all um like comment share subscribe if you want to jump on the timu train like <laughs> once again you see that the items are legitimate they are they did not darn gonna send me this i know they sent everybody else pr which once again timu if you want to give me some discounts if you want to really send me a care package honey diva why would definitely care for one but I, this was $400 of my own money. They did not send me no discounts outside of the discounts that you get on the website. So I don't want nobody thinking that this is a free PR video or whatnot. But honey, I welcome some doing some PR, child. I think I've done a purchase enough from y'all where the people know that the stuff is legitimate. It's going to take you a minute to get it, honey. It's going to take you about three weeks. But when it comes to you, honey, honey, you getting excellent quality for the price. Uh, but also, Timu did give me my own code. They finally said, okay, well, <laughs> she done spent $700 some dollars with us between this order and the last order. So, y'all use my discount code and you can get 30% off your very first order. Yeah, you heard right. In addition to the discounts that you get on the on all of this or the, whatever you purchase off of Timu, you're going to get an additional 30% off. So, like with me... All this came up to 400 some dollars. If I had the 30% discount code, I would have been able to take 120 some dollars off my order. That is massive. So if you want to jump in on these massive savings, uh, also take, uh, take into consideration they do offer the payment plans as well. So I wouldn't recommend using the 30% off for just a, for a small item. I would say wait, you know, get a, get a huge abundance of items. If you're going to go and shop on Timu, 
um, or whatnot. Now, shipping is free regardless. But it, I, I saying, I, I just say, if you want to get your bang for your book, you know, stock up on all the items that you want versus just getting 30% off of one item. You can get 30% off of all your items and you can split the payments up into four different payments. So a $400 order, you take off $120, it goes down to $360. You split it up into four payments. They, they're going to ask you for a deposit um, for $90 and then you pay $90 for um, every two weeks for the remaining six weeks. That's how that would get broken down. So don't think if you don't have the entire 300 some dollars up front that you just got to keep saving. If you got 90 some dollars, honey, you can get your clothes today if it, if it comes out to hundreds of dollars like a girl. But that is it, y'all. Feel free to like, comment, share, subscribe. Let me go ahead and figure out how in the hell am I going to put all this up and darn gonna still fix me something to darn gonna eat. And then this is the night that darn going my internet company would have maintenance. So I might have to go straight to bed because my internet might be out in the next couple minutes. They supposed to be doing maintenance from 1 o'clock in the morning to 6 o'clock in, in the morning. Ain't that's my damn look. I'm hoping that it's not true. I, I'm, at least let me get one episode in tonight and that's it. But that is it, y'all. Let me go ahead and um, bid y'all farewell until tomorrow. Well, 